Today guys we are talking about Roblox animations because Roblox has broken quite a few of them. Yeah this is kind of sad to see. I'm sure you guys know what avatar animations are. You can buy them over on the avatar shop and they're quite popular. Pretty much everyone uses them I guess unless you want like a classic themed avatar. My personal favorite avatar animation is the toy bundle. I think that one looks really cool just like the standing animation is very nice. There's a few other popular ones like the zombie animation, the knight animation, the ninja animation as well loads of people love that one. However guys, like I was saying, quite a few of these animations don't really work correctly. I mean, they still work, they just look very strange. Now I believe this to be more of a glitch than like an official Roblox update. You guys may remember not too long ago, I did sort of like an updates video on the man bundle animation, or you know, like the standard Arthur animation. That one was more of like an official change. What I'm about to show you is more of a bug. Now this only occurs in certain Roblox games. I think it occurs in Natural Disaster Survival, survival, maybe a few others. This game right here, Catalog Avatar Creator, the glitch is happening inside of this game. So let me go and join a server and I'll show you what happens. I will start off by showing you guys the classic ninja bundle. So you guys know what this animation looks like. It's obviously like a ninja sort of karate pose, right? And yeah, normally when you're standing on the ground, that's what happens. However guys, look what happens when I actually use it inside of a game, like on a base play. The character is looking way too close to the ground. I don't quite know if you guys are able to like notice the difference there. Maybe from this angle you might be able to notice it. The character is not supposed to lean down so much like that and it looks kind of odd. I guess quite a lot of people might not even notice this is occurring but yeah the ninja bundle it does look a bit silly I guess. Not too terrible but it is happening on some other bundles as well. I believe on the knight bundle it's really obvious so we can see the knights kind of you know standing like that. Leans back a little bit. However guys when you try this in a game it's leaned back a lot and I just got kicked like usual because because Roblox always has errors these days. The zombie animation has also changed a little bit. Now, I want to show you guys the key thing that's changed about all of these animations. Look at the head, right? You see the zombie's head is tilted. However, if you look at it inside of the game, it's not. So that's the main thing, which is kind of off. It's like the avatar heads. And I can actually show you guys a comparison, like before and after. So here's a tweet from DJ Ninja Roblox. He was just briefly talking about it. He said this thing's been around for three days, I guess four days by the time I upload this and not many people have noticed. But we can see here inside of games, I think that's natural disaster survival. Yeah, it looks like it. And also the avatar creator game. You can see the difference. So like the original bundle compared to how it breaks inside of these games. And if you guys take a close look, you can clearly see it's something to do with the avatar head. Now this is happening because of animated faces. You know, a while ago, actually, maybe not even that long ago, we were talking about animated faces working with voice chat. Well, yeah, that update has broken a lot of avatar animated bundles. So in theory guys, every Roblox game that breaks animations should have the new sort of voice chat plus animated faces update. I guess we can test it out in today's video. If you guys want to try this for yourself from your profile, just go over to your settings. Many of you might have voice chat turned on already. For me, I don't. So if you go into privacy and you go and enable voice chat, just agree to this and go and enable, it should now be working in certain games. There is one thing you have to select though. You must go into style and you must select one of the these animated faces. Stevie Standard is my favorite one because it's like really basic, so I'm gonna use this. And there you go, it's now on my avatar. So in theory guys, when I turn this on and when I talk through my microphone, my avatar's face should move. Let's give this a try. So if I go and turn this on, yes, it's working. Look at that guys. You can see my avatar's face is moving when I'm talking through my microphone. That is actually very cool. I guess the expression is not that good. Maybe if I enable my webcam, cam it might be better actually is that even working i don't know maybe i'll find out my webcam is on but no it still doesn't work okay so that part doesn't work yet clearly but the animated sort of mouth you know moves when i'm speaking that does work even though it's pretty basic without the facial movements i guess it's still kind of cool i did notice though it doesn't work while your avatar is doing emotes but it does work while you're like moving about and running and stuff so i guess it's kind of cool it would be nice if it worked with emotes though if you could dance and like talk at the same time with your avatar's face moving, yeah, that would be kind of awesome. So there we have it. I think that's everything today. I'm like 99 to 100% sure Roblox is going to fix this. It's just a bug because like animated faces is obviously something brand
brand new. They're still trying to figure it out and get it supported with webcams and all of those types of things. Eventually, when this update is like fully working across multiple Roblox games, I think that's going to be awesome. I'm really looking forward to using this. I can definitely find a way to like incorporate this into my videos to make them look cool. But anyway, yeah, that's it for today. See ya.